Hello, my name is uh, Leonard Soss. I'm a creative director here at Triumph Studios. Uh, and together here with the team, we're going to talk about Overlord 2. Overlord is about being evil. You are the guy in charge. You are the Dark Lord. After a day of working uh, or uh, staying in school, you've got people telling you all the time what you're supposed to do. And Overlord 2, you are in control. You know, and being evil is a lot more fun. There is no morals. You can be politically incorrect. You gather a, a harem of mistresses. You build up an, an, a, a dark army of loyal minions, and you sweep over the world, you know, pillaging the countryside and building up your dark domain. At the end of Overlord Raising Hell, the uh, old Overlord got trapped in the abyss. This is where all Overlords end up uh, sooner or later. But he didn't go there before he managed to impregnate his mistress. You, uh, as the Overlad, the, the son of the old Overlord, grows up in the remote town of uh, Nordberg, which is a sort of Christmas winter wonderland. Like whatever evil dictator, the seed of his evil got planted in his youth. And over here you see how he grew up and you know, managed to uh, harass the population and uh, saw how he grew up to become a proper overlord. The minions have prepared a couple of tests for the overlad, just to awaken his evil energy and make sure that he is the true overlord. We got some feedback on Overlord 1 that you couldn't be evil enough. The choices were often more between being good and evil. In Overlord 2, we've made a new tyranny system, which tracks how the player is performing his evil deeds. The choices are between destruction tyranny and domination tyranny. With destruction, you're this demon of death and destruction who just pillages everything and you know, takes the souls of the, uh, the villagers to make new uh, minions and you know, immediately takes their loot. The Overlord, who is more of the dominating type, uh, goes into a town, subdues the people with his dark magic, and they will start to work for him as mindless slaves. So, enslavement versus destruction. Yeah, they're fluffy rats. See, poor fishy, dice many furball. Overlord Two is a lot bigger, better, and more epic than Overlord One. Here it comes. Did we hit something? <laughs> <laughs>